hello and welcome back today in this video we will continue one of our previous video in which we design a MailChimp form using Elementor so if you are interested in how you can create a MailChimp form and then design that form using Elementor then you can watch my previous video and in this video I'm going to show you that how you can display multiple forms on one page and how you can target multiple lists of your MailChimp account using different forms so these are the switchable tabs as you can see this is one form this is another one and this is another one and obviously you can add more fields to this like first name last name email and so on for me email is fine so i just created three forms using email so we will see that how we can create multiple forms using elementor and how we can display them inside these type of tabs so for creating these type of tabs we will need another plugin so just go to plugins click add new and search for essential add-ons for elementor and you will see this plugin is actually runs for Elementor. This is by WP Developer. Once you install and activate this plugin, then you will be able to see these type of tabs. So if I search for tab, you can see we got advanced tabs. We can bring this. And this will give you this look. And if you don't want to use this plugin, then you can use the simple tabs inside the free version of Elementor. So if I search for tab, then we got this thing. Let's remove this or just copy this. We will paste it here. So with essential add-ons, you can create these type of tabs and uh, these are regular tabs inside Elementor so if I drag this you can also have these type of tabs and here you can display the form and uh, as in the previous video we used a plugin let me show you we use this plugin for connecting MailChimp to WordPress and creating a form but unfortunately this plugin doesn't support more than one form and uh, for creating more than one form we will use another simple free plugin which is this one easy forms for MailChimp just copy its name and then you can go to add new you can search for this plugin and then you can install and activate this plugin easy forms for MailChimp and this plugin will allow you to create multiple forms for MailChimp for the same list or for different list so just install and activate this once you activate this plugin then you will see another menu here easy forms just click on this and here as you can see I already have three forms and if you want to create a form you can just write your form name for example testing form and you can write a form description I don't need this so I leave this and then and inside associated list you can select the list that you want to link with this form now if you don't see this list then you have to connect your MailChimp first for that you can go to settings and just write your api key here click save changes and to get your api key just click this this will take you to your mailchimp account where you can get the api key so this is really simple and i showed you in the previous video that how you can get your api key once you have this this then just paste your api key here click save changes and then you will be able to create multiple mailchimp form now let's go to forms here I already have three forms and again you can create a new one here and uh, then you can go to Elementor and to display the form you can just copy its short code. So this is one form let's edit this and here you can see the short code. So just copy this go back to Elementor and if you want to use that plugin essential add-ons and you want to display your form here just click here go to content open one tab and uh, here you can change the tab title for example subscription form you can also change this icon so I usually use arrow for this something like this one and uh, to display the form just remove this text and paste your short code and you will get this form and uh, if you want to display a form in the regular tabs in Elementor you can click this go to tabs and uh, you can put that short code 
and you will get this form so this is how you can display form inside tabs and again you can change the title here so for example form 1 and uh, you can duplicate this three times or four times as many as you want this will be second form and here you can put another short code for example let's go back and i want to display this form so i'll edit this and we'll copy it short codes so usually in these short code only number is different so one two three you can get this now the only difference in these forms is this is associated with this list and the other two forms are associated with other lists so that is the only difference here so let's see and unfortunately we don't have a design tool for this one in Elementor so we can customize this look using some CSS code now as you can see this form is looking this let me show you in the free view so this form is looking like this one and i have changed the loop using the css code let me show you this is the css code i did for the form so what it does is this is for the submit button and as you can see the background color here is this green color this is the border and the text color is white and this is for the button and hover so if i bring my mouse here you will see the background is transparent and everything else is the same this is for the width so this is the width for this input box and this is only for mobile view so if i switch to mobile view then this button will be enlarged let me show you as you can see we got 100 percent width here so using this code you can customize this form and uh, this is how it will look so this is how you can create multiple mailchimp forms and you can display them on one page if you have any questions you can ask in the comment section thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next